No, I'm not going to share examples of people go off script. I think everybody's, we've been given so much freedom to play, even with the lines, that nobody, I don't think that anybody feels the need to be very word perfect, which is so lovely for an actor because we get to, we get to, yeah, just like be a little bit more loose. We've been encouraged to go off script, actually. So at the moment, we're actually all quite script bound. Um, but we are being encouraged to make a lot of the stuff our own. So we'll see as the weeks ensue. Oh, wow. Do you know we have such an interesting cast of ladies who are vegans. We play the most extravagant characters. But I would say most of us actually makeup is the last thing on our minds. The first thing we do is to take off our makeup and put on our flip flops. And so actually you are, I think none of us, none of us are lamb queens. <laughs> I think I can give that a good go. Like four cups a day. Is that a lot? Sean Marco. Yeah. We were in Limpopo in the week. It's coming back to me. We were, we were I think it was like just about midday, 12, in Limpopo at the uh, Palala Game Lodge. And he had already had six cups of coffee. <laughs> I have a, uh, a cast crush. Ooh. Uh, all of them, they're so beautiful. <laughs> this is weird. Mzizi's character is divine. I love it because he's so, he, he has the guts to kind of say uh, whatever he feels like. Um, and he's not apologetic. He doesn't pander. That's my impression of him. Uh, so he's a bad boy. So yeah, his character is quite nice. All of them. I have cast crushes on all my fellow cast members. I, we're all very, very aware of, I think, how wonderful <laughs> the show is, the opportunity is, especially under, you know, the present situation that we find ourselves in. But most especially, we are working with beloved crew. I've worked with a lot of the crew previously, and it's been a little reunion, a lovely crew, and then our fellow cast members are, we're very blessed. I have a cast girl crush, and that has to be Jay Anstey. She is just fabulous. I love her to death, and we really get along so well. We click from day one. She's just amazing. She is who you see, and yeah, I love her to death. She's awesome. <laughs> I mean, it's. I would say, like, from, from the time we've started the, the, the show, I would say, and this is going to sound weird, but my mom, <laughs> Komotso. Look, it's a, a, it's a massively experienced cast. Um, I'm very excited to walk, work with Komotso and um, I, uh, with Marianne, who I've known socially but never worked with before. Michelle Boetis. Yeah, Michelle Boetis, because, I mean, I grew up watching her on, on I think it was, what is it, Swatkat? Yeah, he knows it. Yeah, so I got when I was a kid, I think that used to come on and she was in there. She just, she's always, you know, she, she plays these fierce roles and she's not afraid to, to, to go for it when she's performing. So I think it's really nice to observe her perform. I was very excited to work with most of the people. I think they've, got, they've really put together an, an incredible cast, but Dion Lotz is a biggie for me um, and David Minard, who plays my dad. Um, and I've known Trix for a very long time and we've always kind of wondered when are we going to work together, so that was also cool. But in terms of who I look up to, David Minot and Dion Lotz was a definite like... 